In this video, I'm going to show you one of the most uncommon dishes in Nigeria. I was expecting to maybe get the taste of the cassava, but it's not there. You are going to see that cassava can be used to make something else that is not fufu and gari. Hello guys and welcome back to Epic Food Review, a channel where we show unique food recipes and their origins from around the world. And today we have come to Ecotec Pane local government area of Aquaibum State to show you guys a very rare food. A food so rare that even some locals don't know about it. This food is called Asa Ewa or Cassava Porridge in English. So today I'm going to be watching an Anang person prepare Asa Ewa the way the Anang people prepare it. And I hope it's delicious because from what I heard, this food is very, very delicious. So I'm going to be showing you the step-by-step -step process of preparing this dish. Let's go. Ikotek Baden local government area is mostly occupied by the Anang ethnic group and is located at the northwestern part of Akwaibom state, Nigeria. It is a town known for their rich cultural heritage and important landmarks like the Four Point by Sheraton Hotel. Yes. Okay, it's Asaiwa, uh, not Asaiwa. Yes. So this Asaiwa, I said, I hope it doesn't mean any bad thing. No, 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 no. Okay, so Asaiwa. Yes. Okay, what is Asaiwa? Yeah. Asaiwa is our food. We use uh, cassava, uh, cassava to do this uh, Asaiwa. It's uh, the same as uh, egg bangoko that we use to cook. But this one, we use uh, cassava, not uh, what I am. We use this one. Okay, right. okay, okay. Okay, you said that uh, this asa, asaiwa mm -hmm. is like uh, ekwan koko. Yes. And I know that ekwan koko, they wrap it with kokoyam leaves. Yes. This asaiwa, do you also wrap it with kokoyam leaves? Yes, we use, koko, we use the kokoyam leaf and tie it. Okay, is yes. there any other leaf to use or only kokoyam leaf? Yes, we can use uh, potatoes leaf, we can use pumpkin leaf okay. and tie it. Okay. Yeah. I know that they use cassava to make fufu mm -hmm. and gare. Uh, how come you people started using it to make porridge? I don't know. I come to see as my forefather has been eating. So I follow and it is very good. Okay. Is there any particular type of cassava or is it any type of cassava you no, see? No, mature one. The mature one. Oh, my short cassava. Yeah. Okay, we've talked enough. I would like us to go to the kitchen so I will see how this food is being prepared. No problem. Let's go to the kitchen and see. Alright guys, let's go to the kitchen and see how this food no, is being no prepared. Problem. Let's, let's go. go. The ingredients needed to prepare this food includes fresh cassava roots, palm oil, fresh pepper, onions, bonga fish, salt, periwinkle, crayfish, pumpkin leaves, kokoyam leaves and scent leaves. Start by peeling and washing the cassava. Grate the washed cassava into a rough paste. Pour the cassava paste into a sack bag or sieve cloth and squeeze out the liquid content of the cassava. This is done to prevent this food from causing stomach upset in some people. Add some salt to the paste. Mix it very well while adding a little fresh water and set aside. Cut your kokoyam leaves into small pieces and wash very well. Wrap small portions of the grated cassava with the kokoyam leaves and set aside. Prepare all the other ingredients I mentioned earlier and set aside. Put your pot on fire and add water. Cover and allow the water to come to a simmer. Add your mixture of crayfish and bonga fish into the water. Add fresh pepper seasoning cubes, salt, onions, palm oil, and periwinkle. Stir very well to mix all the ingredients adequately. Taste and adjust any lacking ingredients and cover the pot to allow the food come to a boil. After five minutes, add your wrapped cassava paste into the pot. Cover and allow to cook for 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, add your vegetables Stir the food very well and bring it off the fire. And just like that, your food is ready to be served. Alright, this food is here guys and we are about to taste it. Honestly, it's looking very, very beautiful and healthy. You know when I say food looks healthy, I mean it's green. So, I can see the greens, the vegetable, everything is just popping here. 
Okay, ma, is it how we are going to eat it? Mm. Yes, you use this spoon or you, you can use your hand and eat. That is how we okay. eat. If I want, I can wash. Yes, you can wash and okay. eat. Let me, use your hand. let me use the spoon. This looks too big to enter my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> let me, let's see what uh, acai, acai, wa. acai wa. This is acai wa. Okay. Acai wa. All right, guys. Not that you are. That's that you are. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> Oh, okay. yes. I've gotten what I wanted to get. Oh. Mm. This this food is actually very like a very very healthy food. You know, there there is a combination of vegetables. The vegetables combine together to give it this wonderful feeling in the mouth. You know, the texture is somehow similar to ekwa and koko or porridge jam, but not. Porridge jam is a bit harder. This one is slimy, and I was I was I was expecting to maybe get the taste of the the cassava, like the taste of the cassava, but it's not there. It's just like normal, very rich and well flavored porridge. You know, the the cassava taste is not there. You wouldn't really notice the cassava taste. Uh, it tastes, I think. It's almost like Epan, but um, it's quite different, you know, it's different. Is it sweet, sweet to you? This one? Mm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm trying to understand the taste very well. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, if it's too delicious, I have to remove my cup. Oh! I will. <laughs> no, but it's not like it's not delicious. Mm -hmm. It's very delicious. Mm -hmm. But it's not in the same level with the... Uh, what I was expecting, because my friend that asked me to come and taste this food told me that this this food is exceptional. So mm. I'm trying to get maybe before I finish this one, mm. I can get to the okay, the okay. exceptional okay. part. <laughs> Continue to eat. <laughs> All right. Okay, there you have it, guys. The acai wa yes. uh, delicacy of the aquai bomb people. If you enjoyed this video. Click the like button, subscribe, and don't forget to turn on your notification so that anytime I post food content like this, you'll be the first to know. And always remember, eat to live while I live to eat. So what do you have to say, guys? Subscribe to Epic Food Review. Uh.